already everybody Ooh, there's a skeleton there i do not want to mess with that uh, welcome back to the channel uh this is episode two of whatever i decided to call this series the hunted i think it was i i don't remember but um yeah episode two let's do it um we are being if you're new here uh, i recommend you go watch you know the first episode but um you know, that's just a recommendation that you should take. That you very much should take. Uh, ooh, I should probably take gold armor with me. But yeah, we're being hunted by um, a good friend, Griptide. I am... I know him personally like, pretty well um, in real life. So if I shout his name, I'm going to edit that out. Sleep. Sleeping is a weakness, sure, because if he's near... Nerd. Bruh. <laughs> Fine, you know, I don't care. I'm going to the nether anyways. Um, yeah, so the last episode I was talking about how uh, stupidity is a good friend of mine. And um, we're going to see that pretty soon as I go to the nether here. Alright. I guess we might as well take more wood. I mean, sure, there's like the warped and crimson forests in the nether, but still, I want to have plenty of wood as I can. Plenty of wood when I go in there. I'm going to get an iron axe just because I can. Take this, take that, do this. All right. Now I'm sure you're familiar with uh, like Dreams Manhunts, right? I mean, if you're watching my channel, you've definitely seen Dream. Um, uh, this is not a speed run though. This is just completely for survival purposes. This is war. Um, Riptide's only goal kill yours truly and this is an interesting place to spawn okay, it's fine. I... there's gold up there and I want the gold oh there goes my pickaxe all right So our goal is n not to stay in the nether, alright, it is to get in here, get the uh, achievement, just so Riptide can see it, and then get out. <laughs> that scared me a lot more than it should have. <laughs> Dealt with that problem, alright. This is, this is the risky part, because if he's on the other side of this portal, I'm dead. And look at that! He's not on the other side of the portal. Isn't that amazing? Alright, there is a spider. You know what? I could get, like, a fishing rod. He has a shield. Alright, that's fine. I could get a fishing rod. I could get a sh bow. That's what I meant to say. Bruh. You gave me no string. Bruh. <laughs> Alright. Um, that's two. I could make a fishing pole. Or I could wait. I'm probably going to wait so I can try to get a bow. Would a mob farm be good to make? Like, if I found a skeleton spawner, I could make a... I mean, I feel like it would be. Maybe. I, I don't know. I really I really haven't thought about this a whole lot. But, um... It's gonna go great, trust me. Ow, ow. I want the, I want the creeper to blow up on me. There you go. 
much do we have? Three, perfect. I can make a bow. I have four arrows, actually. I cannot take those out of my <laughs> body. Oh. Oh, yeah. That's what we're looking for. Perfect. Honestly, if we wanted to, we could just torch the village after we're done with it, too. Which would be stupid, honestly. We're not going to do that. We that's That's dumb. You know what we are going to do? We are going to take all these hay bales, though. That is definitely something we want to do. <laughs> we could go kill the Ender Dragon. Take off these beds, just go kill the Ender Dragon. Not because we need to, but because it would be funny. Uh, let's see here. Hot stuff. All right, you have. Good. What the heck? All right, so we do need to make a hoe. Okay, you made the advantage. Hot stuff. Good job. Good for you. Good job. Um, I do not care though. There is a golem here which we will be killing uh, eventually. Can make some sticks. Gonna do that. Grab our cobblestone. We're gonna do that. Do this. Do that. Do that. And we need that crafting table back. So we're gonna drop the feathers. We're gonna drop the seeds. I mean, I said that. Yep. We're gonna take this amazing thing we got here, and we're gonna ditch that. All right, so based on how he, unless he's a genius, he didn't find our portal. Are you coming after me? No, okay. Because if he did, then he would have went immediately. Maybe he would have got the hot stuff achievement just to throw me off. But unless he's like waiting like a minute or two before he goes into the nether, then he's a, he's a genius. Ooh, a bell. Well, I don't really want to give him anything that could alert him to where I am, though. Like, if he finds this village later, he's going to be like, oh. And, oh. Haha. <laughs> yes. Yes, I will be taking that. Thank you. Honestly, this is okay. Okay. <laughs> this is really risking risky to be doing this at night because if I start killing the golem and like a skeleton like shoots me off, we need to go deeper. Yep, he made it. All right, perfect. Yes, yes, a compass. Perfect. Okay. Um, I'm gonna take one of these empty maps as well. We can get rid of the. Uh, okay, 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 okay. This is good. We can ditch that, we can grab this. Now I would like to kill that golem. Maybe not here though. What's in here? Ooh! A stone cutter? I love stone cutters, but I don't think I'm gonna need a stone cutter for this. Yeah, you know what, sir? You go fight those. You know, bro, you go. You got this. Last time I was anywhere near a golem, I got just absolute murked because of my sweeping edge. What do I have here? Why is the garage closing or opening? I don't know. It's one of the two. All right, you know what? Two, three, four. All right. Come here, sir. Why are the creepers coming? They're not mad at me, are you? I don't know. I don't know how that works. Like, do they get mad if they get hit by a creeper, sir? Come on, I got a, I got a great job for you. Come here. I'm not even gonna try to block with my shield. I'm just gonna try to get close so we can kill them. me don't mind me this is why I was scared of a skeleton because if it shot me off I'd be dead hey 
and dead, and dead, and that's a good point. That's actually really good for me. I'm going there. It would be really cool if I got a god apple. <laughs> yeah, yeah, cool. That'd be that'd be really cool. That'd be that'd be really really cool. There's a witch in there. Not dealing with the witch. While I could get a health potion. Tempting. Um, I also don't want to, you know, die. Oh, I want to set up a base. I want to set up a base so bad. Literally the best thing that I could have got. Besides a god apple, maybe. This is like the best thing I could have got from this chest. Um, what are we going to ditch? We can ditch the wood. Oh, there's so many nuggets here, though. So many nugs. What are we going to ditch? What can we get rid of? We can get rid of the nether app. I mean, at that point, it's too late, right? Because if he if he sees that, it's like, ooh, wait, the gold block. The gold block, I want that. I want that, too. Uh, goodbye, bone. No, goodbye, melons. We don't need melons. We do want that, though. Uh, just, just drop it. Yeah, just come on. There you go. I don't think, I don't think looking back, I don't, don't think I got off the hay bales from the village. Definitely not. But <laughs> that's okay. We do have two gapples, and that, now that is good. Alright, um, okay, lots of pigs here, that's fine. We could make a cow crusher, honestly, if we wanted to. I hate the Mesa. I have a different, I have a hardcore world that I just play on. And, like, there's this little patch of jungle I'm set up in. It's really nice. It's like this almost like oasis type thing. It has, like, a cliff. And then a little cliff, maybe a few blocks. And there's a lake. And there's a jungle around it. But the, besides that, it's all, like, mesa and desert for just, for so long. Like, there's a little oasis. And it's nice. But then it's, like, everything else is just this. Kind of annoying, but I mean, uh, what's whatever, right? Yeah. All right. I need to set up a base somewhere. Oh, lagging. So as much as I would want to make, you know, this big, beautiful base, I can't because of the fact of how, you know, obvious it would be. All right, you know what? Oh, I don't have sugar cane. I need sugar cane to do this. I was going to say I'm going to upgrade this map right here and now, but guess what? You need paper. And to get paper, you need sugar cane. Something I have not been collecting. You know, on the other side, if I can see him in a mesa, that means he can see me. So maybe I will set up right here in the mesa. That might actually be a good idea. And gold is uh, good here. You know, it's easier to find gold. Actually, that would probably actually be a good idea. Especially if, it, if I could set up somewhere high. Ooh, it's raining. Thundering, maybe? I don't know, it's pretty dark. Maybe it's thundering. I don't have enough space for sticks. Apparently not. We're ditching the chicken. Creeper. Oh, yeah, because it's dark enough. Wait, how is it dark enough? I think that shouldn't be a thing. Honestly, setting up like right up here would be fine. But uh, I need sugar cane. Perfect. Boingo. Maybe on top of that mesa. Um, I don't know. Ooh, mine shaft. Mine shaft. Mine shaft. Oh, this whole thing's a mine shaft. It's 
That's kind of cool. Get lots of string here. Ooh, what's over there? Nothing. Ooh, this whole thing is a mine shaft. That's kind of cool. All right. Your sugar cane. This isn't going to be enough to upgrade our map fully, though. Unfortunately. Um. Thunderstorm. I was right. I just need three more pieces of sugar cane. Or a piece of paper and it'd be great. I do not have any of those, though. I do want to go over there. that you know what I want to do I want to explore that mine shaft but I know I should wait till I have a better map well, I guess it shouldn't matter isn't he's not gonna find me but also he might and that scares me and I see no sugarcane whatsoever there's a skeleton that's not a sugar cane. I could take him for bones, so I don't really drown. Sir, you can't shoot me underwater. Oh. It's an interesting looking cave there. You know what, I'm thinking I should, uh, I have it on the map actually, it's fine. It's fine. It's okay. I still need to stay by the river though, so look, I can look for sugar cane. Uh, should I just, should I just farm the sugar, no, that's dumb. I don't need to farm the sugar cane. Maybe I should have farmed the sugar cane. <laughs> Alright, um, what is over there? Sugar cane, I see it. I see it. It's over there. It's right there. Perfect. Alright, I'm going. Okay. So my plan... Zombie coming at me, but that's okay. Down there. My plan is going to be to get lots of maps. Look at that. Lots of maps so I can like keep track of where he's moving on the maps, but uh, that's just my plan. All right. Ice bucket challenge. What is that? That's a baby zombie coming at me. What am I gonna drop? Nerd. All right. Um, isn't that obsidian? Who's cutting onions? He's in the Nether. He's trading. Or he has diamonds and he's no. He no. It would have said. No, 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 no. My mind is running with all kinds of things. Like maybe he made it to a bastion. Maybe he found a diamond pickaxe inside one of the chests. And maybe he is mining obsidian. But no, 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 no. Uh, I would have said those were the days or whatever. So no, he is trading. Or I guess he could have found a. Um. Ruined portal chest? I mean, that he could have also done that. True. Um, I'm also... I'm gonna say I doubt it, though. Just because... 
don't know, he's he's probably trading. That's that's my that's my guess. Um yeah, so we're gonna have to we need to run back because I wanna check out that mine shaft. And then after we check out the mine shaft, we're gonna go ahead and just head down. Um, south. We're gonna head south on the map. You know what? Should we just make a boat? No, we shouldn't make a boat. Should we make a boat? We probably should make a boat, but I'm not gonna make a boat. Actually, if he is in the nether, he is definitely in the nether. 100%. I can see it without a doubt. Unless he was already in bed. No, this is just a big mind game. I hate it. Oh my goodness. Just gonna casually swim through here. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to think of things to talk about. I know I said I need to get better at commentating, but this, you know, it isn't going very well. Um, I don't know how many stories I told from my vacation I went on. Um, maybe I could throw another one of those out. Is that just Boingo, let's go. Let's get that. Um, maybe I'll go, I'll go back and look at the video I made in, uh, yes, 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 eh. And I'll, uh, see what stories I still need to tell. What is something I haven't told? Um, there was one night, I guess, um, where one of my, that didn't sound fun. Uh, where uh, one of my cousins uh, threw lemonade on me. Like it wasn't, it wasn't a whole lot. They just like a little, like a few drops. Like no, it wasn't. It was more than a few drops. All right, it was. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, it was a decent amount of lemonade. They splashed it on me, and I was like, bruh. And so um, I got also, I also got a cup of lemonade, and I splashed it on them. And um. They were like, what the heck? And so they filled up their cup of lemonade and they were coming at me. I was like, oh, no. And so I ran away. And um, yeah, and so this particular cousin got all of the other cousins together. And um, like we were, we were in like the mountains, um, like like it was, an, it was a nice place. It was, there was trails and stuff. And so I'm running down these trails and stuff, and she got this, and she got like all of the cousins in on this, and they're so they're all chasing me like through this like forest. The fallen rift I burned it out. Okay. Anyways, uh, yeah, they're all chasing me through this mountain, and so, I mean, I'm having a fun time, because I am, I don't mean to brag, like, I don't want to sound like I'm bragging, but I am, left the game again? Turn the game again, interesting. I am decently fast, is what I'm trying to say. Um, and I'm one of the older of the cousins, and so, like, none of them could really, like, keep up with me, and so even if they like, did see me, I'm, they're like, oh my gosh, there he is, and then I'm gone. Oh. Yikes. Like I just I just run away. It's not it's not hard to outpace a bunch of like three year olds. They they're not three, but um that's what it felt like. So yeah, I'm running through the mountains, and at one point, you know, I'm getting tired. Like I'm a sprinter. I run track, right? I'm a I do I do sprints. I do not do distance. Distance is disgusting. If you run distance, uh, kudos to you. I guess you're you're a psychopath. Um. But I'm running sprint. I, I do sprints. Right? I I was sprinting around up and down these trails. So I'd sprint around. I'd sprint away from them. I'd hide. When I got my breath back, I would you know walk around. And if they found me, I'd sprint away again. And you know, it's just a you know rinse and repeat strategy. Um. 
so yeah eventually they didn't even catch me either like at, actually at one point uh a bunch of them did and like i uh ducked off the path i didn't i didn't run very far because they, they actually like cornered me and it was i was impressed a little bit right, it was the best like, strategy they had so far but they ended up like cornering me and um like some of the like little ones like jumped on my back and stuff and i was just like you know i could throw you just off my back just yeet you completely but you know i probably shouldn't kill my cousins um so yeah so i didn't kill anybody regrettably but uh yeah it was it was it was all fun they they caught up to me a few times but they you know they didn't last very long because like even after that they were like holding onto my arms and stuff and they're like okay don't run away now we're gonna take you to camp like the you know around the tents and stuff i guess they're gonna like put me in like some kind of prison or something i don't know and so i just um you know i was like okay okay let's go we can go whatever and then as soon as we started walking i shook him off and took off again oh hello sir like it was not hard to ditch these children at all so yeah there's that story um yeah I, I, and I just I just kept running like all night just kept kept going kept running kept running away from them eventually um I got just, I got bored <laughs> I get bored very easily and um, I just like sat down and looked at the stars because let me tell you that was beautiful I live like I live in a town, right? I live in a town, a city. There's like always lights on, and you can't you can't really see the stars very well. But um, so I, I thought I thought it was I thought it was super pretty, um, just being able to sit there and look at the stars and stuff. And yeah, that's 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 the story. I just sat there until eventually a group of them found me, and we just all vibed there for a little bit. And then we went back to camp, and they were like, "Oh my gosh, where were you?" And I was like, "I was everywhere. I was following all of you." Which I mean, it was partly true. Like some of them, uh, so, like some of them were just walking along the paths, and I would just you know just for the kicks, just like go and follow them. They didn't know I was following them, of course. They would hear sounds, or they turn around and hide. But, um, yeah, it was fun. You know, just freaking them out. <laughs> there was some paths that would, like, twist back on each other. Like, I guess, like, hairpin, almost. I don't know if that's a term, but I'm gonna use it anyways. And so, these paths are, like, right next to each other, but you can't really see them. And But there's, like, bushes and stuff, because of, like, you know, the bushes and stuff, the foliage. And, um... So yeah, I would, I would make like noises, like almost like even growling noises, <laughs> and they just freak out, and it, it was great. I mean, it was like mountain lion country. There were bears apparently, but you know what? I guess who didn't care about that? Me. I had better things to do than to get eaten by something. Right, if it wants to eat me, go ahead. There's nothing on my body, anyways. I'm skin and bones. All right, if it, if it wants to go through the trouble of, I mean, I'm, I can, I don't, I doubt I could outrun a mountain lion, but like, if it wants to track me down and, um, kill me, I mean, that's on him. He's going to waste the energy, not me. I am scared. Yeah, he's going to waste his energy. I am not going to waste my energy. We are getting, actually, we're nowhere close to the border. Never mind. We're gonna head to like the center of this map to set up camp. And then we're just gonna start. We should probably make an underground camp. Oh, that would be cool, actually. If we could find a big old like underground cavern, we could set up down there. Cause I still wanna build things. Like this guy, like Griptide's not gonna Griptide's not gonna find us very soon. That, that's that is that is what I am counting on like if we could find if we could find a big old ancient city or something That would be very dangerous because if I die even if it's not by his hand if I die at all You know it's over 
but um, I'm stupid. But um, yeah, I, I lost my train of thought. I don't know what I was talking about. I was talking about running away from people. Uh, something, something, bro. But yeah, if I can find a big old cavern and build down there, I think that'd be cool. So we're gonna head to like the center-ish of the map. And uh, yeah, we'll do that. We'll get down, we'll find a big old cavern. And this video has gone on for very long. So guys, um, thank you for tuning in today. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Um, I don't really, I'm not the best at commentating, I know. But if you're here and you're watching the video, I mean, apparently you like something. So, I mean, even if you want to give me like topics to think, things to talk, things to talk about in the comments, in the comment section, you know, that could really help direct my train of thought. Um... So yeah, guys, thanks for watching. I will see you guys next time. Bye.